we're on another walk. Let's go for it. Now this is going to be an exciting video, isn't it? Can I just say uh, yeah. that Min claimed that she wouldn't be able to film another walk because there was going to be no sunshine for the rest of the week. Whereas I'm pretty sure if you just look over there, I don't see anything the there. Smell something in the air. It's a gorgeous morning. Hi, I'm Jordan. Very in-depth grid. Have a good one. Let's go swimming. You've got long wellies on, you have to worry about it today. True. You can splash around all you like. Yeah, I'll still probably get mud on myself somehow. I so, guarantee you. So this is quite illustrative of uh, traditional British countryside walk. It's got to be local. Within 15 minutes. So this is really normal for people in Britain to do, right? On a, almost on a daily basis even. Depends where you live, yeah. I see a bull in the field. There's a bull. I can't really see it. Where's the vineyard? That, this. Oh, you can see it, that's a vineyard. British wine's very good. Don't listen to what people say. Nightingale, which comes from over in that direction, is a sparkling white wine. Gorgeous. So how much is that for a bottle, Jack? For a high-end bottle, you're probably looking at like over 50 quid. 50, oh, but Jesus. But you can buy some younger ones for more like 30, 40 quid. Right, it's still quite expensive though. Oh, it's still expensive, but for a special occasion. The rosé wine that Rick Stein yeah, tasted on Cornwall. That uh, camel, uh, camel valley. Camel valley. Camel valley. I really would like to try that. Yeah? Yeah. I quite like to go to Cornwall. Yeah, to Never been to Cornwall. Morning. We're approaching the cow stoppers. They're just too dumb to cross this, didn't you say? Yeah. They don't have the dexterity. <laughs> Isn't dexterity to do with hands though? Okay, but whatever it is, feet. Lol. These sort of barn houses are quite common where they used to be part of a farmyard. Also, weirdly, we've got bamboo here. It's quite an odd one. So, oh, and then here on the left, you can see we've got some hives for honey for bees. Bee hives. in the UK. It's and it's common. called a common. Right, you're so funny. Jack, it's not funny. I'm so 
seen any dogs though. So. Hello. Are you sniffing me? Hello. What's up? Bye bye. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Yes, it's lovely. We don't get a lot of this often. <laughs> Have a good one. Have a good one. Bye. Open the gate. Close the gate. Hello. Yeah, into the traffic, not alongside the traffic direction. Oh my god, I'm boiling. Yep, I am hot. Oh, you've actually got me saying that. London. I used to be such a city girl, obviously growing up in Seoul, but now it's just so loud and I love a good night out, of course. But I think really you've got the best of both lives at the moment because your family's outside London, but very close enough for you to go back and forth quite easily. And obviously you've got me in London, so you can come and stay, see your friends, do stuff. <laughs> I know. And home sweet home. Thanks guys for joining us on our walk. Bye guys.